Hello, everyone, and happy Friday to you once again. It's not often that you see me here on Friday, but I'm happy to be here. Here's a breakdown of the week ahead. Now, we are expecting cold temperatures overnight. Some of us will experience freezing temperatures, but we will be warming up, and we're already in the middle of our warming trend. We'll have mostly light winds for the rest of today and tomorrow, but winds will start to pick up. They'll be low and breezy by Sunday, and then blowing dust is expected Monday all the way through Thursday next week. So let me get right into my forecast. Over the next 12 hours, by 7 o'clock, we should be in the upper 40s. By 9, low 40s. And then overnight, we're going to bottom out with temperatures below freezing. 30 degrees is what I'm forecasting in El Paso. 27 in Las Cruces, 30 in Alamogordo, and 20 up in Cloud Cross. So certainly a chilly night up on the mountain, but tomorrow our warming trend continues. 65 will be the high in Vado. Same thing in La Mesa, La Union as well, and 66 in Santa Teresa. In El Paso County, it'll be 65 in Fort Bliss, 67 in Socorro, Clint as well. 68 in Fabens and in Hudspeth and Culverson County. It'll be 63 in Dell City tomorrow afternoon and 66 in Van Horn. We're expecting mostly sunny skies across the area and our temperatures will top out at 71 on your Sunday. So definitely looking forward to that. Our average high this time of year should be around 64. We're going to keep those above average temperatures all the way through Wednesday. And then we'll start to cool down by late next week, looking at temperatures in the upper 50s. Our winds is what I'm concerned about. I'm not for tomorrow, though. Only 10 mile per hour wind speeds by then. Sunday will be low and breezy, like I mentioned. But Monday all the way through Thursday, we're expecting wind gusts anywhere from 30 or 25 to 30 miles per hour. These numbers could change. We issue first alerts when wind gusts reach 45 and above. As of right now, not looking to be at that level, but we'll definitely keep you updated on that. But my other concern is the direction. The winds are going to be moving out of the southwest, the west-southwest, and that's going to be a similar situation of what we had a few days ago with all that blowing dust. The blowing dust will be picked up and blown across our area at 30 miles per hour, so it could be a little bit uncomfortable for the rest of this next week. Your weekend forecast in El Paso, 65 on Saturday, 71 on Sunday. Las Cruces, 64 on Saturday, 70 on Sunday. Once again, those low end breezes. And your 70 forecast sponsored by Mattress Room looks like this. Beautiful weekend is what we'll have. And then your President's Day, that's when the winds will start to pick up all the way through Thursday. And we'll have a low chance of rain by Thursday with that lower, with those lower temperatures as well.